Good morning, YouTube. It is Saturday, Vlogus 13th, and it's going to be Saturday morning cartoons Saturday. So I've put on my favorite PJs, and I'm going to go lay out on the couch and watch cartoons all day. I'll be back in a bit to let you know what I think. All right, so I'm back, and I have to say that I was hoping for more. Now, I stuck with just local channels, because that's what I had as a kid, and I wanted to make a comparison. But when I was a kid, there were cartoons on every channel all morning, and that just wasn't the case now. There was only one channel that had cartoons all day long, and the other ones had some, but but not very much. Uh, one channel, uh, ABC, just had live-action shows from the Disney Channel. Uh, another channel seemed to be focused more on little kid, uh, little girls, um, and like one show had uh, these girls with brightly colored streaks in their hair and horses with corresponding brightly colored colored streaks. Didn't seem like a bad show, just wasn't my cup of tea. Um, PBS had stuff for littler kids, um, and it was more uh, educational stuff. Though there was a pretty good educational show on Fox. I don't remember the name of it, but it took place during Revolutionary America and focused on these two teenagers that were somehow uh, connected to the Founding Fathers, and they were witnessing the signing and the writing and signing of the Declaration of Independence while they debated the different issues involved. Good show. Um, but the channel that had cartoons all day was the CW, which mostly consisted consisted of Dragon Ball Z and Yu-Gi-Oh. It had a couple of episodes of Sonic the Hedgehog or Sonic X, I guess. But it was like lots of episodes of, of Dragon Ball Z and Yu-Gi-Oh. So epic, intense battles all day long, which kind of were funny in and of themselves because they were so over the top. But it wasn't the same type of like comedic relief and uh, fun times that I guess I was accustomed to as as a kid. Now, I did watch action shows like The X-Men and um, Ghostbusters and um, Ninja Turtles, which those cards are Ninja Turtles cards, and that's actually a really good example because it was an action show, but it was, it was also very much a comedy show. It had a lot of jokes and a lot of gags all throughout it. Uh, other shows that I watched, um, well, I've got the Hanna-Barbera stuff up here. It wasn't on uh, Saturday mornings all the time, but occasionally it was. Um, that would be Scooby-Doo and um, Yogi Bear, Jetsons, and Flintstones. Other shows were like DuckTales and Tailspin that Disney did and Animaniacs, which was entirely underrated. Um, and it was a great show. It came on in the afternoons um, of, during the week, but it was also a Saturday morning cartoon before that. So, I kind of missed that. One cool thing that's still going on with Saturday morning cartoons is the commercials. The commercials are geared towards kids, because that's who they're wa who's watching, I suppose. So they're much more exciting, much more um, entertaining. And so that was kind of cool. If I could have a playlist on Netflix that just kind of, I could pick a show here, pick a show there, and kind of create my Saturday morning cartoons, that's what I would do if I had the option. But if I am going to do another Saturday morning cartoon day, someday, I think that I will probably just watch what they've got on Netflix, because they've started having X-Men, and they've got Inspector Gadget, and uh, a number of other things. Um, the one thing that I really wish that they had, that I, I guess I just never thought would go away, was Looney Tunes. They've been around forever, and I searched throughout the day to see if any of the local channels had Looney Tunes from early in the morning all throughout the day, and they didn't, and so that was kind of sad. Um, but yeah, so hopefully Netflix will continue to add some great cartoons and maybe even make a playlist option. But that's it for Saturday Morning Cartoons Saturday. If you guys want to tell me about some cartoons that maybe I didn't mention uh, that I should check out, let me know down in the comments. And I, I hope you enjoyed my thoughts on, on the whole thing. In the meantime, have a great one and don't forget to be awesome.